Why do you want to become a receptionist? Every one of us has some skills and is good in doing something. I believe that people enjoy talking to me, that I am a good listener, and that I can identify their needs and help them to satisfy them. That's my reason for applying for the receptionist role. This job is repetitive. What would motivate you to do it well every day? From my point of view, this job is not repetitive. I know that receptionists do the same things again and again. But there are problems we need to solve, and new guests and visitors we talk to. This job is fun to do, not a repetitive one. Some tasks may repeat, but it doesn't make the time and work boring. At least that's how I feel about my job. Tell me about a situation where you needed to manage an upset individual at the reception desk. How did you handle it? Once, I had a very loud and aggressive person speaking to me at the receptionist desk asking to speak to my boss. I maintained a very even voice so as not to escalate the conflict. I explained politely that my boss would contact the customer at his earliest convenience and thought he would make sure that happened. He calmed down and left, seeming satisfied. A person calls and asks to speak to someone who isn't available to talk. What do you tell them so they will feel you are doing your best job to enable them to connect with the person they want to speak to? I tell the customer, Miss Smith has stepped out of the office for a meeting. As soon as she returns, I will let her know that you have called and ask her to return the call. She should be able to get back to you by end of day. What types of software have you used in previous jobs? I have been using Microsoft Office software for my 10 years as a receptionist. I am also proficient with Google and Microsoft calendaring software, Google Sheets and Docs, all common instant message platforms in Slack. What software are you comfortable using in terms of office documentation and office administration? I have experience using the full Microsoft Office suite, including Access, and I also have experience with some specialized software like Outlook and Google Drive. What do you believe the receptionist brings to the office culture at any company? A receptionist is the first face that most people see when they enter an office. Therefore, it is important to represent the company's values and culture from the first contact with that customer. As a receptionist, I strive to do this in every interaction. How do you or would you manage confidential information? I would make sure that confidential information couldn't be easily seen by visitors on my desk. I would not give out personal or private information to anyone unless the individual has authorized it in advance. If the person requesting the information were insistent, I would try to verify that they are authorized to receive it, but without that confirmation, I would not give it out. What's your typing speed and error rating? I haven't assessed my typing speed recently, but I'd be happy to take an online assessment and send you the results after our interview. I believe my typing skills are every strong since I've typed up countless academic assignments. I'm also very detail-oriented and ensure my work is always carefully proofread and edited. Can you describe your ideal relationship with your office? I really enjoy cultivating a good relationship with the office I work for. I want to be a source of clarity, precision and evenness in the office. I want to make people's jobs easier by virtue of being there. How do you manage your workload when it's really busy? During my last semester, I was managing five courses, and three of them had final exams scheduled over the same two days. I also had assignments due during that time, so I had to prioritize and be extremely organized. I set out a work schedule ahead of time so that I could ensure all my time was being used effectively. What do you think is the most essential quality for a receptionist to have? A great receptionist has excellent organizational skills, is a valuable resource that employees can count on, and has a positive and friendly attitude at all times. A receptionist is the first face of the company that many clients will see, so it's vital to make a great first impression. Do you have experience with multi line phone lines? I haven't had the opportunity to operate multiple phone lines, but I am confident I would catch on pretty quickly. I'm very willing to take training in advance of my start date if I am selected for the position. Have you applied for any other job opportunities? Yes, 
since I'm currently not employed, I am actively pursuing a few different opportunities. However, a position with your company is my number one choice based on your corporate values and the diversity that this role offers. How do you keep yourself organized? I am naturally a very organized person. I have certain systems like my calendar for making sure I'm always on time for commitments, and lists to make sure that I get everything done each day. I love keeping documents separate so that files are always handy and never get mixed. What sets you apart from other candidates that we're interviewing for this position? If you select me for this position, I would wow you with my organizational skills and the amount of work I can handle. I love putting out fires and solving problems for people, and I think that would make me a great receptionist. Conclusion The bottom line is this, be prepared, do your research, and understand the job you are being interviewed for and how your skills, personality and experience match the job's requirements, close the interview with questions, pass on your calling card if you have one, thank them for their time and give a firm handshake before smiling and saying, goodbye.